Hey, welcome to another episode of GeekOutdoors.com. So on a previous video, I talked about backing up and restoring your OBS settings, specifically your profile settings. But today I'm going to be showing you how to do the same thing for scenes. So this is a very similar process, except the difference here is it's going to back up your scenes right here and you're also able to restore or import it. And so if you go down here, I have multiple scenes. And whenever you are creating these scenes, it might take you a while to recreate them. And so this way, it makes it really easy to back up and restore them. So let me show you how this works. So the first thing I want to do is I actually want to back this up. So we'll go to scene collection, then we'll go to export. And here, this is really important. Whenever you name the file, make sure you have the .json extension or JSON extension. So I'm going to call this scenes backup. All right, and then .json, we save it. So now that we have those saved, uh, let's go ahead and remove some scenes. So I'm gonna remove these two scenes right here. So I'm gonna remove this one. And I'm also gonna remove this one. All right, so now I remove those two scenes at the bottom. So now let's go ahead and restore them or import them. We'll go up here to scene collection and there's an option for import, so we choose that. And then you're gonna choose the folder that it's in, so there it is, and we'll say open, and then import. So once you've done that, you'll notice that there's no difference in the scenes. Well, that's because it created a brand new scene, so if you go up here to scene collection, now there is another scene. So what it does is, whenever it imports it, it names it the same as your scene that you're using right now, but it'll add a number two to it. So we'll go ahead and go to main two. And if I scroll down, there it is. Those are the scenes that I had previously. And that is all that you have to do. It's a very simple process. And I'm really happy that OBS provides this for us so that we don't have to redo everything again. So that is it for this video. If you actually did want to see my video on backup and restoring profile settings, I'll leave that in the description area below. And if you did want to see more of my OBS tutorials, tips, and tricks, I'll also leave that in the description area as well. So as always, if you did get value out of these videos, be sure to share, like, and subscribe. For professional virtual business locations, check out Anytime Mailbox with more than 1,300 locations worldwide at affordable rates. For more information, check out the affiliate link in the description area below.